This is my water changing system. This is hosing from our spot out there. Well, that's that. And this yellow one is the hose out. Going out to water. A lovely garden, as you can see. Now, I will do that until the temperature drops. <coughs> 24 degrees. <coughs> Stop stop playing the noise that it will get, then I'll stop it. And that's what I do. I've got a big pond pressure filter with a little pump in there, and a big pump pumped up to there. And this just goes back to the back of there into the other tank. See where the water comes in. And I've got my but honestly, it takes so long for the water to drop that amount. Like about an hour. It's longer than, um, yeah, it's longer than floating <coughs> fish to get used to the temperature. Sporty! What's up here, wee Sporty? <coughs> and here's my other tank. Which I don't feel <coughs> the same because it's smaller. I, uh,. <coughs> Use my. I've got a ho, I've got a shower attachment, and I run it <coughs> pretty much the temperature it comes out. Zebras, guppies, Congos. Oh, I've got a shoal of chain poachers, which are lovely. <coughs> and as you can see, I've had this grammy since it was about two inches long. I've had that giraffe cat, which is what, 34 inches? It's a 30, 40, 48 inch wide tank. I've had him since he's about 3 inches, 12, 13 years. And a sharks. Garas that actually breed in here. Bristle nose that breed in here. It's a nice male. More garas. All bred in here. Oh, and the dolphins breed in here. So, I don't recommend it. You do what, you, what suits you, but this is what I do. I make some of the sculptures, pottery, it's an old table that used to be black until my watermelon chewed on it and made it white, but didn't hurt it because it's not going to. It's a nice big male bristle nose. Got time suits. Yeah, it looks like the temperature's dropped. It's dropped one degree. So there you go, and there's my little friend. <laughs>